Hey there, it's Chris from White Oaks Farm. I hope I've got this thing aimed right. Anyways, I just picked up four chicken transport crates um, from a trucking company. They didn't really want to deliver up here at the farm because of uh, the tight winding roads and low trees and things, so I met them elsewhere. Anyways, they're some assembly required. What you do, and again, I hope this thing's aimed right, you cut the ties that bind. There are four of them. This is the top. This is the gate and doors, or gate and walls. And these are the long walls. And these, you just line up. It's easier to do on the floor, so let me move it off the generator. And push until they snap in place. And you do the same with the other one. For the other long side. And then make sure that you line up these things so that they're facing the crate because they lock the crate together. So it can't spread. And then you spin it around. And this is where I made the mistake on the first one. I wasn't paying attention. And when I put these short guys on, I put them on like this, and I had to get them out because they go like this, so this holds that side. And unlocking them is not trivial because they got a, a stub on both sides that holds them in place, so it took some time to get these two unlocked. But you put that together, this is the one of the doors. And I actually found that it's easier to install it after putting the top on. <coughs> and this is the top. Now, important thing about the top is that one end is set up for the door and the other end is set up for the long side or short long side. And I wasn't paying attention because I got up too darned early and I put it on backwards the first time. Boy, did that take me a while to get it off. But this is the way it's supposed to go on. Come on, there we go. If you look, there's the flat here. On the other end, there are all these sockets for the uh, posts. And what I found was easiest to clamp, clamp it down is go and just Make sure it's aligned, of course. Come on now. You were on there beautifully earlier. And step it down till you hear it click. It's worth going around a second time to make sure. And then you can flip it up on end and put in the door. Long tabs go to the outside, short tabs to the inside. Oops, make sure you got the spring latch portion. And it goes basically snap it into place, snap it into place, and there's an assembled chicken crate.
two more to do but since the chickens don't go for processing till the 18th I got time anyways that's Chris at White Oaks Farm saying hey chicken crates bye